great care of myself every single day. I am grateful for everything and everyone around me. I found exercise, staying fit and healthy as my daily priority. I am strong, powerful and confident. I have discipline in all areas of my life. I will not settle for a mediocre life. I stay true and faithful to myself and my mission and still be the best wife, mother and a friend. I believe in my abilities to figure things out. Therefore, I do not allow myself to be overwhelmed. I have a clear vision of my purpose in life and I do not put guilt on myself for following my dreams. I dream, visualize, plan and follow through with my action. I seek no approval, yet respect others. I strive to be a better version of myself every single day. I understand that success is a journey and not a destination. Therefore, I must put in the work every single day. I have a beginner mindset and learn new things every single day. I make no excuses and accept any. I am confident that I will be adding more to this creed as I get older, wiser, and learn more from those who had done it already. No excuses. Hello guys, this is Eva Eckert, coach of Operate to Dominate personal development program. And I am here today with Jen. We met at the high performance event, which is really cool, fun event today. And we're taking that moment to capture very important parts of our lives. And I want to talk about coaching, life coaching, mind, body, and business that we are doing here at Operate to Dominate. So Jen, thank you so much for giving me that opportunity, giving me that moment to speak and share about the coaching with others, people that will be watching that video later. Yes, so Jen, uh, just to make us more relaxed and like there will be a lot of people watching it, but how, what made you decide to go for life coaching, to, to, that you sign up with this program? Uh, so I, so I actually, my business partner worked with your business partner and husband. Yes. Um, Steve and um, my operations manager as well at my firm did the same, and they both came had, had wonderful results. Um, I was a slow learner <laughs> and um, um, kept kind of putting it off and saying, "Well, I have too much work to do. I'm I can I, I'm just kind of waiting for that perfect moment when my life was all in order and that I could then I could put the time in for the coaching." And um, and thankfully you and. And Steve actually pushed me and said, this is the time to do it. I was in the middle of um, a very busy time in, in work, and um, we went ahead and we did it. And um, I, it, it was um, the best decision I've ever made, actually. Mm -hmm. so. But I remember like you were procrastinating with that decision, because there were a couple of emails sent, and oh, you yes. still didn't do it. <laughs> And, but then something happened, something clicked in you. Yeah. Do, do you remember that moment? The, the, what, what, what was the deciding factor? Because there's so many people, and I'm sure that some of you will be watching this video and you will gonna find yourself like, wow, this is me, I'm, I'm a procrastinator. I am definitely a procrastinator, and I, I, I kind of thought to myself, I'm going to be, at that, I'm 53 now, I was 52 at the time. I said, your life is going the exact same way. I was, I'm, I'm successful. I mean, I'm, a, I'm an attorney and business owner, so I, I, my life has been successful. But I, there were things that I was, you know, I, I wasn't happy with the way I washed. I wasn't happy with my weight. I wasn't happy with my nutrition and my um, and my um, just my routines and um, and really was just very had a very negative mindset and mm -hmm. thought I just need to change this and maybe this is like the key to doing it. I had done some coaching in the past that hadn't been very successful, but I think it was because I hadn't really put in the work. But I will say that your method is so much, it, it just, the other coaching really didn't go of the whole, the whole picture, the whole person. It really was, it was very much um, just business, just business. And I feel like I don't think I could have done this without having my everything kind of in place. So this is such a great way of putting it that the mind body and business 
works together. So this is again, so thank you for sharing this and showing this jam to everyone that you see business by itself, uh, it's just such a, it's a big part of our lives, but yet you cannot have a successful business without putting that work in you, in your mind, in your body, right? It's like, you have to have a full range of colors and develop these colors fully so you can glow and be successful in the business. So we've been coaching for quite some time right now and how your life has changed since since the coaching. What can you what can you tell people that it's so different? I mean, I know this, but I don't want to put hello, I don't want to put my words into you. I want to hear this from you. Um, so, I mean, we started in, I think, middle of uh, the February or so, um, uh, since it's June now, so since then I have, I've lost 19 pounds. Um, 19 pounds? So, well, since when? Hold on. Since when? Since February, 20, like, the end of February. Admit, but actually probably I have all my dates, but I want her to <laughs> say it. <laughs> oh, is that right? Okay. <laughs> I want her to say it. Yeah. 19 pounds we have today is june 25th i remember because yesterday was my son's birthday in such a short amount of time such a drastic change what else so okay wait yes. awesome and um i mean you I've, I've always worked out but not but not regularly i now feel compelled to work out every day. All right, so uh, so 19 pounds weight loss yeah. and what so, else? And, um, so and some nutrition and, and exercise yes. um, has become much more um, intentional. Mm -hmm. um, I'm, I'm definitely, I, I, I try to work out, you know, every day at least or, you know, seven, six days a week or so. And my food, um, I really I used to stress eat. I mean, I just, especially at night, I was eating good during the day, and then I was, and, and now I'm, I'm just, I think about it more. I, I, what you train me to do as far as not being hungry, um, or you know, eating throughout the day, and I'm hungry. It's just, um, I feel so much better. I feel so much healthier. Mm -hmm. yeah, mm -hmm. So. And there is that, that, so, so, so much information here for you guys, but then yet recently you, Jenny, you told me how mindful you are about so many other things in your life. So many aspects, right? And then how do you think this can help you that mindful? What is, what is that? Okay, being mindful, what, what's happening like in those moments when you, when you see that? Well, I think the biggest take away from this is, is, is my attitude so I'm I'm much more um, I, I look I look much I much more look at the positive mm -hmm. things, um, and um, realize how much I have you know and, and how um, the things that I, I the wins that you tell me you know that you kind of identify now I'm, I'm identifying them more um, so the, so to me that the, the mindfulness is really more like I'm, I'm, I'm seeing the good. I'm seeing the positive. I'm reframing my focus, which was, was to get tended to always be the glasses as half empty or you're broken. <laughs> so, so I, it, it's really um, just feeling good about myself and my and, and making good decisions and just even um, journaling and understanding and, and, and like identifying things like this is something that I'm grateful for. This is something that I'm. Um, that I'm, I've done for somebody, you know, or this is, you know, I, it's it's been a the mindset is, is is a very big deal, and I and I have people at work um, saying to me that said that there's such a change, which I that's think is, amazing yeah. in <laughs> so, such a short, really yeah. amount of time. Like think about it, like we're talking about four or five months of a change, and everybody realizing it, not your physical, but yeah. your emotional side, right? Yeah. And decision I mean, well, making. the physical, but, but it's definitely been more of the mental because, mm -hmm. um, it's, it, I've heard, you know, I've heard that before I really lost all the weight and, and um, it's just that my mindset is that I'm just I'm more confident. I mean, you know, I gave up, um, we had to do a big company event that I spoke at. We, you know, I was very complimentary from the staff. It's something I don't do well at speaking in public, or at least had not done, you know, was always very nervous about. So um, the confidence that this has given me is, is, is just fantastic. <laughs> this, these are such a good world, guys. And uh, we are here just, she's here with me to really inspire you that 
this can happen. And what can you tell Jen to the people that are like, they they don't understand even to have a coach, to hire a coach. What, how this can help them? What, what could you tell a person that was in similar situation as you were? But then also, not everybody is obviously an entrepreneur. Like you are an entrepreneur. You own your own business. But to anyone, any, any other person out there. I mean, I think... Um, I, I, think, I think everybody does need a coach, honestly. In fact, my daughter, my daughter said, why, why aren't, can't you give me a coach? All right, so your daughter okay, mentioned so something yeah, about... So, so just because, because I've come to her with many many of the different points that, you, that we've worked on, I've given her some advice on some of the things that you, your the routines, and um, so I, I just think you, you, you were at the seminar right now, and you were getting amazing advice on how, you know, how to how to live your best life and how to how to move your business forward or your life forward and you know and you walk away from something like that and you get into your daily routine. I mean, obviously, I procrastinated so long in doing this. I knew what I needed to do. I totally knew. I knew what I needed to eat. I knew I needed to exercise. Um, I knew I needed to be more positive, but I didn't really know how to make that happen. And and so the coaching that like, kind of creates. Accountability and gives me some tool, gives me the tools that I need to kind of look in, in, inward and to make the changes. And um, so it's that's to me that's yes, and, everybody would need it. And, <laughs> and the outcome is there. And you've been enjoying the journey because that's oh, okay. another thing, yes. right? Because yes. some people you you can't be fully present and give a hundred percent of you if you're not gonna enjoy the journey. I mean, I look forward to all my coaching calls. I look forward to coaching call with her. It gives me so much uh, presence and so much attention and so much great energy when I coach people. And I love it. I live with it. I love it. And it's so obvious because you do, your energy does it. it I, I walk away from the calls really energetic, really, you know, um, really motivated. I know I'm not 100 percent compliant on some of the things that I'm supposed to be doing, but oh, um, we're not but, perfect. But, but That's we're the not thing. Perfect. Yeah. So, but it, but the things that I have been doing have definitely it's made such a difference. I mean, yeah. yeah. Let's put it this way, victory. I mean, in such a short time, weight loss and and movement in your company and being on the same page with others and pushing the and and, and really accomplishing small those those small things and big things that you had on on your goals, yes. right? On yeah. your personal yeah. and uh, company goals. So yeah, pushing things forward that again, I've had I've been there for a while and just just sort of just stay just stay in there. I don't know what you know what, what I needed to do was just a little a little push and then mm -hmm. and that's, um, you kind of gave that I think the coaching did that even, even once a week it just or just the work and the inspiration that you provide even during the week, you know, with texts and, and communications. It's just nice to know there's somebody there that has your back and it's, it's kind of making you yes. forward. Yes. So. Yes. So thank you so much Jen again sharing this. Thank you for being inspiration and, and thank you for trusting the process. And, and, and really doing your work because as much as I can give to you, you need to give out to yourself and to the universe. That's what it is. It's like the energy exchange that we need to do and you did it. And that's the outcome. So I hope you guys got some good stuff here. We really hope that it was a good content that you take something out of it and don't procrastinate because time is this, this the time is ticking. So is. Each, <laughs> each moment that you say next day, next week, it creates a bigger space and you stay farther from your goals. That's how it is. Instead of just driving and pushing forward, live with that moment and go for it. So yep. thank you so much for watching. No excuses. Bye. Thank you.